so these are not African violet seeds. I ordered these from, uh, I want to say it was Amazon. Yeah, it was Amazon. The seller was supposed to be Chinese, but I'm looking at the, um, the return address and it says Cambodia, so. I don't know what this is, though. If anybody recognizes these seeds, please let me know. They look, they look like some kind of a nightshade relative. They almost look like tomato seeds, but I'm pretty sure that's not what this is. You know, I want to say they look like, not like eggplants, similar, not quite, Some very similar to tomato. Anyway, I was supposed to get like 200 seeds of African violets mix. And this is what they sent. They sent two packets. <clears throat> so I opened up the the envelope, and um, there's like there's like one packet. I, I found a little packet. And I was like, oh, this isn't right. And I looked in there, and there was another packet. I said, oh, well, you know, maybe they sent me um some free seeds, but no, it's two of the same. I'm so angry. Anyway. That'll learn me. Do not buy seeds from Chinese sellers. I've been burned too many times. Many people have been burned by them. You know, sometimes you get the stuff and, you know, you know, you're always taking your chances. It's almost never... It's almost never a uh, good outcome, so I would say, I'm, I'm going to say never more, but I know myself, I'm going to get tempted, <clears throat> but never more. I'm going to say never more, okay? That's it. No more, no more stupid Chinese, you know, $1.99, no shipping, takes like you know, a month and a half to get here. I'm not going to do that again. I'm going to stick to the trustworthy seed sources. That's it. Thanks for watching. <laughs>